Good Sunday morning, Kolkata. Hello, India world. This is FSQ, French School Quiz, your one-break Sunday morning quiz show. In this brand new season and format of FSQ Junior GK Miniseries, three teams qualified for the four team finals by winning semi-final games. And then the losing semi-finalists met once again in the gold quest, that is to fill the last slot. The winner of last weekend's game, that is the Sultan of the semi-finals, was Birla High School for Boys. And they joined the first three finalists, APJ Park Street, Calcutta Boys School, and St. Joseph's College Babazar School Team. And that's how we get our four team finals. And over the next four weekends, there will be three-way matches so that everybody faces everybody. And then we are going to have grand finale matches between the two teams with the two top scores. Today, we have the first quiz contest of the final rounds between APJ versus BHS versus CBS. Which team will put a dominating score on the board? That is the question, and we will know the answer in less than 30 exciting minutes. We are streaming on FB Live and going live on air on your fab frequency, 91.9 Friends FM. And let us now get introduced to the teams in alphabetical order. And Team A is APJ, and they are represented by... Good morning, everyone. I am Sajid Goswami of Class 8 from APJ School Park Street, and I'm glad to be back for the finals. And we, our team, will try our best to win and hope we can manage to qualify for the final rounds as well. Yes, of course, Sujit, and your partner is? Hello, everyone. I am Guman Ghosh from Class 8, APJ School Park Street. I'm glad to be back and super excited for the FSQ Junior GK, and I hope for the best. Well, I'm super excited to have the two of you and I can hear bird songs from Upamanyu's end and that is really something, is it not? And I can make out that you guys woke up really early and are feeling bright and feeling fresh and will give this quiz your best shot. That is the APJ team. And next we have the team from Birla High School for Boys and they're represented by... Good morning, everyone. My name is Arjun Sharkar. I'm from class eight and I'm representing Binla High School. I'm very happy to be part of the French School Quiz Finals and I'm looking forward to a great day of quizzing. So are we Arjo and your partner is? Good morning, everyone. I'm Debarshi Bhattacharji. I study in class seven and I'm representing Birla High School. My hobbies are playing cricket and football and reading books. It is great to be back for the finals of the FSQ and I look forward to a great day of quizzing. Absolutely, the Boshi. And I don't know whether I'll have some cricket and football questions for you, but I am sure you will do very well in any case. And the third team is CBS, Calcutta Boys School. And we have on their quiz team, 
Hello everyone, my name is Sishan Thal. I study in the H standard of Thakurwai School. My hobbies include karate and reading books. I'm also interested in quizzing. It's great to be back for the finals of FSQ quiz and I hope to give my best. Best of luck to all the participants. Thank you. Well, that's the spirit, Ashan. And your partner is? Good morning, everyone. My name is Tishan Chatukhan. I study at the 8th standard of Calcutta Boys School. My hobbies include swimming and reading books, and it feels really enthusiastic and excited to be back for the finals. I hope for the best and good luck to everyone else. Well, I too wish the very best of luck to all the three teams. And here is round one, Inside Edge. Round one, Inside, Inside Edge. Edge. A round of direct questions on India and the world. One direct question per team. And if it is not answered by the team getting the direct, it will move on the rebound as a bonus chance to the next team and then to the team after that. 100 on the direct and 50 points on the bonus. Here are the three Inside Edge questions starting this quiz. First question for APJ. And APJ, represented by Upamanyu and Sujit, your question is, which neighboring country gained independence from the British in 1948 and was ruled by armed forces till 2011, when a new government began ushering in a return to civilian rule, but is now again under a year of emergency imposed by the military. Sujit, um, it is Myanmar. Myanmar, yes. Yeah, Myanmar or Burma. Upamanyu and Sujit, after a round of discussion, are both quite confident that it is Myanmar, which was previously called Burma, and that is the correct answer. Good, solid start, APJ, and you pick up 100 points, and the next question is for Birla High School for Boys. Birla High School for Boys, Deborshi and Arjo, look sharp and try to answer this one. Can you name NASA's largest and most advanced Mars rover that successfully touched down on the Martian surface on Friday in a nail-biting landing that marks its first step in the search for signs of ancient microbial life on the red planet. They both say, I think it's resilience. Okay, resilience, go with that. Yes, sir, we'll go with resilience. Well, you know, it's a sound alike of resilience, but it is not resilience. I am sorry about that bad miss, VHS. The question passes to CBS. Let's check their answer. I think it's, it's Mars Perseverance. Perseverance. Yes, Perseverance. Yes, yes. Perseverance is the correct answer. Bad Miss VHS and well done CBS. 50 points to CBS. The rover streaked through the Martian atmosphere and landed safely inside the vast Jezero crater on Mars after traveling for 200 days and traversing more than 472 million kilometers. Scientists have determined that 3.5 billion years ago, the crater had its own river delta and was filled with water. After 50 points on the bonus, will CBS be able to pick up 100 points on the direct? Let's wait and watch. As I give this direct question to Ashan, and Trishan from CBS. And here is a question from food and straight away from the dessert section. Can you name the delightful French dessert, which is a delicious blend of caramelized sugar sauce topped over custard made of a mix of egg and milk along with vanilla essence? It's one of the most popular continental desserts in most restaurant menus. Ashan, I think it would be pudding. Not sure. Okay, go with it. Uh, so we're going with pudding. 
Well, that answer is not accurate. Bad news, CBS. Question passes to APJ. Um, Sujit, do you have any question? I think so. We should pass. Yeah, we can pass it. APJ passes that question to BHS. BHS, who could not... Devoshi, it's a crime caramel. I'm 100% sure. Okay, okay. Well, BHS answers creme caramel. The answer that I was looking for is caramel custard, but I'll give it to BHS for creme caramel. And nice to see BHS finally finding their mark and picking up 50 points. Which means that at the end of round one, APJ has 100 points and CBS and BHS are on 50 each. So APJ has taken an early lead, but this quiz here today has three teams which are equal in their caliber and competence. So the teams from BHS and CBS are not to be taken lightly. Watch out for the second round as things are likely to get heated up here. And second round of FSQ Junior GK is a full-on audio round on music called Incredible. Round two, Incredible. Incredible. Three questions coming up. That means one direct per team. Once again, 100 points on the direct and 50 points on the bonus. And APJ, this is your question. Listen to this clue and name the profession of the character that the lead actor plays. Sujit, um, I uh, it guess it's an army officer. Yes. I would guess it's an uh, officer in the military. I think army officer or freedom fighter. Army officer is not the or APJ. Perhaps you could not zero in on the film and that's how you went astray with your answer. Question passes to BHS. Deboshi, do you know the answer? Is not answering. They are hesitating and dilly-dallying there. And the question moves on the final bonus chance to CBS. Aishan, do you know the answer? I do not know the answer. Well, the movie is Swades, where the central character of Mohan Bhargav, played by SRK, is a NASA rocket scientist who returns to his homeland. No points to anybody for that question. And that was A.R. Rahman singing in his signature style. Question two for BHS. Now identify the singer who teases his sneakers brand by turning the corporate campus of the sneakers company into his playground. Remember, you don't have to name the company. You have to name the singer. Crazy down bad, what they had didn't last. Damn, baby. Sometimes we laugh and sometimes we cry, but I guess you know now. Baby. I took a half and she took the whole thing. Slow down. BHS. Hey, Bushy, I think it's Drake. I'm not sure. Drake, I'm not sure. Go with that. So we'll go with Drake. This is the Canadian rapper Drake featuring American rapper Lil Dork. Well done, BHS. And this video was shot at the Nike headquarters at Beaverton, Oregon. The Sebastian Cole building serves as the opening scene where Drake is seen pulling up in an unreleased Mercedes Vision Maybach 6. Watch style. 100 points to BHS for making it look easy breezy. I like their style. And this means I'm just left with one question. And that is the direct for CBS. And here is the question for CBS. Listen to this classic song and identify the TV series 
10 seasons of which will now be available back to back on Netflix. It's like you're always stuck in second gear When it hasn't been your day, your week, your month CBS, what's your answer? Ashan, do you know it? No, I do not know it. Ashan and Drishan do not know the answer and the question passes to the team from APJ. It's so many friends. friends yes. Yeah, we will go with that. That is the correct answer. This is the famous duo, the Rembrandts, singing the opening song of the Friends. And the opening song is as, is as famous as the series itself. And those of you who have joined us late are tuned in to Friends School Quiz on 91.9 Friends FM. So where are we after two rounds? Stay tuned for the scores, plus two more cool rounds coming up while the quizzers gather their wits and we play these messages from our partners. The time now is quarter past nine. This is Christian De Bonic, and I will see you on the other side of this little break. And I will acknowledge our audience who are enjoying this quiz as much as the quizzers who are playing with me. Our number one do. Every time we technologically could advance, in the computer taking and protecting it to Shamoshai Porici, Army computer take a computer tamaki, Kiki music to watch him. I want to go Sahaju Juno Ponto Tesis with the Bulegalo, my computer clicker, my computer clicker. Ari Baba me tie wish the Pachina, Nijay Bari Tebose, and old computer clicker clicker. frequency <laughs> Hey, it's DJ Butter. Make sure you tune in to the official world chart this week for new music from Hedy One, Rita Ora, and this from Dua Lipa. Dua song and the top 20 songs in the world this week on the next official world chart on Saturday at 9 p.m. and Sunday at 8 p.m. exclusively on 91.9 Friends FM. Ciao, ciao. <laughs> প্রধানমন্ত্রী <laughs> <laughs>
সামাজিক সুরক্ষার কি হয়েছে কি হয়নি নির্বাচনের আগে জানতে চোখ রাখুন আনন্দবাজার পত্রিকার আজ সামাজিক সুরক্ষা যাওয়া পাওয়া ভোট বঙ্গে আনন্দবাজার পত্রিকার সঙ্গে আর আমি আয়ুষ্মান খুরান আপনাদের জানাতে চাই যে লোকে তো অনেক কিছুই বলে আস্তেমার ব্যাপারে আজ থেকে লোকের কথা নয় নিজের ডাক্তারের কথা শুনে আস্তেমাকে হারাও ইমোদের সাথে নিয়ে আর নিজের স্বপ্নগুলোকে এগিয়ে নিয়ে যাও এমন খাবার বানাও যে লোকজন খেয়েই যেতে পারে এমন খেলা খেলো যেন প্রতিপক্ষের ভয় পেয়ে যায় ইমোদার যদি সাথে থাকে তা আস্তেমা তোমায় আটকাতে পারবে না যদি আকাশকে ছুটে যাও তবে ইমোদারই হলো সঠিক যদি অবাধ জীবন কাটাতে চাও তবে ইন্ডিয়ারই হলো সঠিক কোন গন্তব্য আর দূরে নেই আস্তেমা থেকে ভয় পাওয়ারও প্রয়োজন নেই কেননা আস্তেমার জন্য ইন্ডিয়ারই হলো সঠিক অবাধ জীবন এই জনসচেতনতার উদ্যোগ নিয়েছে সিবলা এই জানো আজ বিয়েতে তোমার গিফট করে খুললাম তা কি কি পেলেন ম্যাডাম আরে তো বড় মাসে দিয়েছি প্রেস্টিজের মিক্সড গ্রাইন্ডার ছোট মাসে দিয়েছি প্রেস্টিজের কোকরে বিদেশে দিয়েছি প্রেস্টিজের হ্যান্ড ব্লেন্ডার তা কই আমি আমি বুঝি ও গ্যাস ওভেন ওয়াটার পিউরিফায়ার আর ও ভেজিটেবল এন্ড ফ্রুট জেনারেটর এটা বেশি সেগুলো প্রেস্টিজ তো বিয়ে করে আমাদের কেমন প্রেস্টিজ বেড়ে গেল বলো প্রেস্টিজ ইনোভেশন যার উপর আপনিও ভরসা করেন সতেরো থেকে একুশে ফেব্রুয়ারি বিএনসিসিআই ফেয়ার গ্রাউন্ড রাজার হাট নিউ টাউনে অনুষ্ঠিত হতে চলেছে তেত্রিশতম ইন্ডাস্ট্রিয়াল এরিয়া ট্রেড ফেয়ার সময় দুপুর একটা থেকে রাত আটটা থাকছে কন্টিনিউস অন ডিফারেন্ট সেক্টর বিভিন্ন রকম ইন্ডাস্ট্রি স্টল আর প্রত্যেকদিন বিভিন্ন জেলার ফোক আর্টিস্ট এবং ট্রেড আউট আর্টিস্টদের মিউজিক্যাল পারফরমেন্স চলে আসুন তেত্রিশতম ইন্ডাস্ট্রিয়াল এরিয়া ট্রেড ফেয়ারে মাননীয় মুখ্যমন্ত্রী মমতা বন্দ্যোপাধ্যায়ের নির্দেশে এবং মাননীয় চেয়ারপারসন ফিরহাদ হাকিমের ব্যবস্থাপনায় কলকাতা পৌর সংস্থা নিয়ে এসেছে ওয়েভার স্কিম দু হাজার কুড়ি সকলের সুবিধার্থে আরো বেশি সুযোগ এখন এই স্কিমের সময়সীমার মধ্যে যে কোনো দিন আবেদন করা যাবে আগামী আঠাশে ফেব্রুয়ারি দু হাজার মধ্যে আপনার বকেয়া সম্পত্তি কর পরিশোধ করুন আর পেয়ে যান সুদ ও জরিমানায় একশো শতাংশ ছাড় তাহলে আর দিন কেন এখনই নিন এই সুযোগ বিস্তারিত জানতে ও আবেদনের জন্য পৌর সংস্থার ট্রেজারি বা কমন কালেকশন সেন্টার বা ই কলকাতা নাগরিক পরিষেবা কেন্দ্র ও সংশ্লিষ্ট অ্যাসেসমেন্ট কালেকশন দপ্তরে যোগাযোগ করুন অনলাইনেও আবেদন এবং টাকা জমা করা যাবে বিস্তারিত জানতে লগ অন করুন ডাব্লু 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 ডট কেএমসি জিওবি ডট ইন FM RJ Hunt sees a new normal winner is Sangram Chaudhary. Hi, I'm Sangram. I'm RJ Hunt sees a new normal finalist. I'm a winner. 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 I'm really overwhelmed. I'm a winner. I'm a winner. I'm a winner. I'm a winner. Thank you, Ma. I'm a winner. I'm a winner. I'm a winner. And thank you to my friends. I'm a winner. 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 Thank you so much, everyone. Congratulations. 91. Hello and welcome back. You are tuned in to Friends School Quiz with me, your quiz master, Krishnendu Bonik. on 91.9 friends fm and lots and lots and lots and lots of friends are tuned into our radio show and similarly lots of them are following the show on our fb stream and saful khan says good morning everyone sudarshan ghosh says all the best manson roy and ratan roy say good morning sir shobal ghosh once again asks what about audience question i will ask an audience question shortly he also says it's the best school quiz i never miss it and finally he says sir you are looking great your t-shirt is excellent well shoibal what can i say if i was salman khan i would have opened my t-shirt right now and i would have gifted it to you but alas i am not so i am going to keep my t-shirt and i'm going to keep wearing it but your audience question is coming up and shoma datta says hi ujjani roy says lovely show and 
Mala Chatterjee says, good morning, all the students. So all in all, lots and lots of love being shown by lots and lots of you all. And here is an audience question and you can post the answer as a comment on the FB page of 91.9 Friends FM in the show post. And the question is, what style of food are quesiladas and enchiladas? But now the most important thing, the scores that you have been waiting for. And at this point in time, after two rounds, APJ Park Street on 150, Birla High School on 150 as well, and Calcutta Boys on 50. So back up CBS, and it's time for round three in person. Round three in person. 100 on the direct with a question with four options and 50 on the rebound for the correct answer on the bonus. When the number of options automatically come down to three or double up when it's your direct and straight away prevent your opponents from getting a bonus chance and get 200 on the direct by giving the correct answer. In case you have chosen to double up and then your answer is wrong, you get penalized and you get minus 100. Strategize as you quiz, play straight or double up. And the first question goes to APJ Park Street. APJ Park Street, how are you feeling now that you are in the driver's seat and leading the quiz? Nervous I and think excited. We'll, we will try to keep up with the... We will maintain a lead. Okay, but a little nervous nevertheless. That is understandable. And the time now is 26 minutes past 9 o'clock. And here is your question, APJ Park Street. And your question is, penguins live almost exclusively in the southern hemisphere with only one species found not of or near the equator. Can you name them? Before I give the options, you have to decide whether to play straight or double up. Um, yeah, we'll play straight instead. What are your options? Option A, tropical penguins. Option B, white dove penguins. Option C, Galapagos penguins. Option D, there is no such species. Sujit, can we go for there is tropical no such penguins. Tropical penguins. Yes, that sounds uh, the most promising. But I think we can go for none. Um, okay, let's go for none next one. Mm. So are you going for option D? There is no such species. Yes. That is not the correct answer. But since you are playing straight, you don't lose any points. And BHS gets the same question on the bonus chance. Option D is now taken out of the fray. What is your answer? BHS. Hey, do you think it's the Galapagos? Galapagos, yes. I, yes. Ah, yes. Galapago penguins. Yes, yes. Sir, Galapago penguins. That is the correct answer. Well done, BHS. You pick up 50 on the bonus and you also get the next question. In 1986, President Ronald Reagan signed the legislation to make what? The floral emblem of the United States. Before I give the options, you have to decide whether to play straight or double up. Deboshi, let's play straight, straight if you're not sure. So we'll play straight. The Birla hires are playing straight, not taking any unnecessary risk. And their options are option A, white lily, option B, rose, option C, maple flower, option D, white daisy. Deboshi, I think it's white lily. White lily. White lily. White lily. Is a wrong option. Now that option is taken out of the fray and the question moves on the rebound to CBS. CBS, Ashan and Trishan, what do you say? Ashan and so can I... Daisy. Okay, we'll go with Daisy. You want to go with White Daisy? No, no, sir, no, sir, no, sir. Sir, I first want to hear the options one again. One yes, second. Sir. I'm sorry, I can't repeat the options. 
So we will go with then option none of the above. So there so is. So we will go with what? There is. So we will. So so we will go with option D. Option D. Option D. Why this is not the right option? So Birla Hires went for White Lily. Then CBS went for White Daisy, and both options are wrong. Now there are just two options left, and APJ has the final bonus chance. Is it Rose? Yes, it is the Rose. We go with Rose. It is the Rose, and APJ boys have picked up fifty points on the final bonus chance. Well done. And final question for CBS: Which of these is not a type of a German Shepherd dog? Before I give you the option, you have to decide whether you want to play straight or whether you want to double up. I think we should double up. Okay. Wants to double up. They are lagging behind, and they want to use this chance. To catapult themselves, good move, guys. And here are your options: option A, White Shepherd; option B, Swiss Shepherd; option C, King Shepherd; option D, Himalayan Shepherd. So, Swiss Shepherd. Swiss Shepherd is actually a German Shepherd dog. Since you doubled up, you lose points. and because you doubled up no other team gets a bonus chance you have prevented your opponents from getting any bonus chance the correct answer is there is no himalayan shepherd i just invented that from my imagination sir sir i said so i said the swiss one sir i said the swiss one not the himalayan sir so you misheard me i said swiss Yes, so that is not the correct answer. The correct answer is Himalayan Shepherd. Himalayan Shepherd is not a German Shepherd. My question was, which of these is not a type of a German Shepherd dog? And your answer was Swiss Shepherd, which is a German Shepherd. A Himalayan Shepherd is not any type of a German Shepherd dog. Please pay more attention. And with that, we come to the end of round three. And at the end of Round three. The scores are as follows: APJ on two hundred, BHS also on two hundred, CBS having lost fifty points have come down to zero. But I'm sure they'll score again in the fourth round. And the fourth round of FSQ Junior GK is in store. Round four. In store. If you feel an adrenaline rush the moment you hear the word rapid fire, then try scoring bullseye with every question in this round, and you will be asked three rapid fire questions from a random mixed bag in forty-five seconds. Each of you will be asked three rapid fire questions from a random mixed bag. In forty-five seconds, fifty for correct and twenty-five negative for wrong answer. And APJ, look sharp and best of luck with your answers. We'll start your time now. Question number one: What shape is common to a cricket stadium and the office of the president of the USA? It's an oval. Correct. Plus fifty. Question number two: The Statue of Unity is a colossal statue. Which Indian statesman and independence activist? Sardar Vallabhai Patel. Is correct. Plus fifty. Question number three: What does GG mean on Facebook and other social media? Good game. Good game. Good game. It gives a fist bump when clicked on. Well done. You got three out of three right with ten seconds to spare, and you have added one fifty to your score. Three questions coming up for Team B BHS in just. 10 seconds so boys get your act together play and slay and here is question number 1 ananda samarakun has written and composed 
the national anthem of which neighboring country? Pass. Question number two. A naval aircraft carrier is a type of what? It is a type of ship. A warship, but I'll give it to you. Question number three. Which fairy tale heroine lived in the tower and let down her hair for the planes to climb up? Rapunzel. Rapunzel. Rapunzel is correct. You still have five seconds. Do you want to retry question number one? Yes. Uh, Arjo, I think it is Sri Lanka. Should we go with that? This is the correct answer. And that is the correct answer, BHS. And you to have answered three out of three questions in 45 seconds. You don't have the liberty of discussing answers in the rapid fire round. The moment I hear any answer, I take that as the confirmed answer of the team. CBS, look sharp and best of luck with your answers. Don't worry about the scores of today's quiz you will have two more games, but I wish you luck with the last round. And your time starts now. A hieroglyph. A hieroglyph was a character of which ancient writing system? So the Egyptian civilization. Is correct. Question number two. As Rola Garo is to the French Open, Flushing Meadows is to? The Australian Open. Incorrect. US Open. You lose 25 points. Question number three, is Neapolitan a type of pizza or ice cream or both? Ice cream. The correct answer is both. You lose 25. A Neapolitan pizza has tomato sauce and cheese with basil mostly. Neapolitan ice cream is composed of three separate flavors Vanilla, chocolate, and strawberry arranged side by side in the same container. Hard luck there, CBS. Let's find out the team totals today, which will be carried forward. But before that, let me find out whether any of our friends have been able to give the correct answer to the question. Although I got quite a few correct Although I got quite a few answers, I have not got the correct answer, which is quesaladas and enchiladas are Mexican style food. And the team totals today are as follows. CBS has effectively not scored. APJ has scored 350 points and BHS has also scored 350 points, which means APJ and BHS will carry forward 350 points to their next matches and have done well for themselves. If you liked the show, then like and comment on the FSQ post on the FB page of Friends FM. That was the quiz in today's FSQ Friends School Quiz. This is Krishnan Dubonik. Bye-bye. Have a nice Sunday.